Last time on, Island Camp. The teams put up to their test on the trivia challenge. Each team has to get five questions in order to win, but to my stunning expression. The Crystal Swords took their crown back from the gaming hardcores after they took their crown back from them, before all that, Kathy learns and found out that Tracy was the one who framed her. In the end, right before I was about to say something to James, he has found my statue. It means that whoever finds the statue cannot be eliminated off. Which means that Tracy, who has the second most votes is eliminated off the island instead of James, making her leaving the island. There are 10 campers left, and 2 out of the 10 campers will end up leaving the game. That's right folks. We are having another double elimination, that means if one of the teams loses, they will still vote the same way. But instead of handing cards out, I will reveal what two campers will end up leaving the island together. So, it starts right here, right now on a very special episode of Island Camp. I can't believe that Jose saved our skins from the last challenge. Yeah, if he didn't save us, we would have been screwed. Agreed. Hey guys. Hey Jose. Jose, thank you for saving our skins from the challenge. You're welcome. Also Jose, where's Tom? Oh he's outside behind the cabin. He's planning on how we can win the next challenge. Oh, okay. So, I don't know what's going to happen within the next challenge. But all of us needs to remind ourselves that we need to keep an eye on James because he might screw us over, which I hope not because then we might get down a member of our team again. Um, Sandy, are you okay? Yeah, I got bored easily sometimes. Oh, okay. Why don't we walk around the island? That sounds a good idea. I'm so pissed off the fact that James had the statue of John and Tracy trying to be a sassy pants to Kathy. I agree with you on that and that surprised me. I thought that Tracy was a good friend to us. Also, if James calls out team to lose again, we will vote him out since he already used the statue. Yeah, fair point. As long as we keep an eye on James for not helping us, then we will be good. Now, it's obvious that James can't do shit, makes it better for me, Monica, and Kathy to win the next challenge. All that matters is that, we need to full on win it. Now, hold on. How on earth we can't tell if James can't do anything? Monica, you gave me an idea. Like what? How about we have Kathy carry James the entire time? That way, he can't do shit. That's a great freaking idea. I actually do understand how we're going to win this. Thanks to me and Zoe. Our plan might work. But Kathy needs to know the plan, before the next challenge gets announced. Girls, do you have a plan to make James not do anything? Oh yes, we do. I was thinking you'd carry James so that way he can't do shit. That way, we have a chance to win. Parenting without him causing us losing again. You know what, I love the idea. Let's show him who's the boss. Guys, we have an issue. Um, huh? what? What is it, Tom? So you guys remember that one challenge that we did two times? Yes, we have. Well, we are about to run again. Oh, hell, no, not again. I literally almost passed out in the very first challenge of that and that was horrible. Yeah, usually I carry Reggie halfway during the second challenge. Well, thank God I have you. Attention campers. Meet me outside of your guys' cabins for next. And final team challenge. Let's get it going, boys. I'm praying that we don't lose. But if we lose... We're toasted. Alright campers. I know what all of you are thinking. 
why are we doing the same challenge again for the third time? Well, you start right here where the cabins are. From there, you guys have to make it to the beach. That will be your halfway point, and lastly, you will see the ceremony where you see your guys' logos. That means it is your finish line. Also, there's going to be a timer within this challenge. If you are further away from the zones, you are automatically lose, and there's a reason why. Once you step on the zones, you guys are no longer in teams. Oh hell Holy no. Holy flashing rolls. Oh no. No! Shit. This is every man and woman for themselves now after this? One more thing, you got 20 minutes to get to the zones. If you don't, you lose. Now, on your marks. Get set. Go. Hey, why I'm being picked up? Shut up and let us girls win the challenge. My gosh, this is funny. I did realize that James got picked up in the air from one of his teammates. This might screw us over. Hello everybody. I am now here in the ceremony. As you saw and can see, all the stumps had to be removed for only this challenge. That way, we don't have to deal with cluttering space in the area. Now going to what is happening right now. The gaming hardcores are taking the lead. While some of the crystal swords are right behind them. Oh, that is it. I want you to put me down. Sure. Whoa, some sand gotten in my eye. And that's what you get from ha, messing ha, with ha, the girls ha, like ha, that. Way to go, Kathy. Thank you. Guys, we need to go. Um, what? She's right. Oh shit. Would you look at that? This is what he deserves. Hell yes. Let's go. <laughs> oh come on, Jose. Jose. That's not how Mario's voice sounds like. Oh come on. What the hell? Oh. Hell no. I don't know why that James is on the ground. But, I'm happy about that to be honest. Thank God, my eyes are clearing up. Wait a second. Damn it. Most of everybody is there. See you later, rich man. The fuck? Come on, Reggie, you can do this. Oh, you got to be flipping kidding me right now. Move out of the way, kid. Hey, I'm not a kid, dumbass. Oh. Hell no. I'm not getting last place again. Crap, I need to catch up. Wow. As you guys just saw. That was funny. Anyways. Kathy, Zoe and Monica from the gaming hardcores are getting close. As well as Roy, Reggie, Tom, and Jose from the Crystal Swords. We're almost here girls. Yes, a few more running to go. Indeed. Now thinking throwing James to the ground was actually funny, and giving us girls the advantage to win. We're almost there guys. We can do this. I can see the zones, yes. Come back here you idiots for making me falling behind. Come on the sun, don't do this to me. We are here. Congrats the trio. You guys are safe. Let's go. Safe, 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 and safe. Here we go again. James, I'm surprised. You are safe. Let's fucking go. Oh, God shit. damn it. Tyler and Sadie. You guys came in last. However though, you guys are actually both eliminated. What? Huh? Wait, don't tell me that it's been over 20 minutes. I hate to say this. But it is over 20 minutes. That means it's time for you to say goodbye to your team. Well, this is it. I'm now eliminated off the island with Sadie. But, all this time. I have been thinking about her, and now it's time to me to say it. I'm actually into her. The Crystal Swords. I just want to say that two of your teammates didn't pass under the 20 minute mark. Shit, we forgot about Tyler and Sadie. That is correct. Don't worry guys. Don't worry about us. Even though we had problems for a little bit. All that matters is that you guys come a long way. Yeah, even though I was quiet to keep things to ourselves. I just want to say that. Good luck and take out James for us. Don't, Don't worry. worry, we will try our best to take him out. We all promise to take him down. Well you two, it's time to go to the boat.
Tyler and Sadie. Thanks for playing. I will see you next time. Hold on, before we go. Sandy, I've been waiting for this moment since it all started. Same. Do you want to be my boyfriend? Yes, I do. Huh? The hell was that about? By the way, I did say that we were supposed to be voting, but I decided this way for this challenge. Now back to what I was about to say. Eight campers down, eight more to go. What will the campers do? Once they all merge into one, and how will James survive from the two group alliances? Stay tuned in the next year and after another aftermath on Island Camp.